Thank you, ladies and gentlemen. I am pleased to provide you with some information concerning my topic, which is religiosity in motion. A very brief look on the situation in Slovakia. Um, the material was provided by docent Kamil Kardis, who is unfortunately not present here. And uh, my job was to structure the material into the presentation. There's a single question I would like to start with, but I can make you sure that there is a bunch of others we are going to finish with. Can we the dynamics of religiosity in Slovakia described prim primarily in terms of secularization or desecularization? In order In order to deal with this question, we are going to make a very brief look at the two sociological research projects addressing the topic that had been conducted within the last few years. The one of Josef Matulnik and his team, and the other one of Andrei Stefaniak and his team. Dotson Cardis participated at both of them. There are obviously some other projects concerning the topic. For example, the one of Dr. Tijik, who is present here, and which possibly can be discussed later on. There is a regular census every 10 years in Slovakia, which includes religious affiliation inquiries since 1991. Here is the overview of the religious affiliation of the Slovak citizens based on censuses uh, from 1991, 2001, and 2011. These very raw data can provide us it's a very raw view of what uh, religiosity in terms and in limits of such kind of investigation uh, can be.